Hello. So I've filmed various times uh, my juicing, juicing process. Um, here I am going to use celery. Okay. Uh, a piece of pi fresh pineapple. This over here is uh, spinach. And uh, this over here is kale. Uh, we have apple. Uh, I am now going to continue and cut up a couple more things. This is supposed to be a cleansing. Uh, I used to do, um, <clears throat> uh, I'm cutting some ginger, by the way. Nice piece of ginger. Okay. Uh, maybe I'll cut this end off. I used to do irrigation cleaning, which is um, cleaning out your colon, pretty much. So I have all this memorized and... Um, I've done it on and off throughout the years. I, I've done it so far for two years straight with a couple of interruptions, I'll admit. Uh, there was one time I interrupted it for a couple of months. But I've been pretty consistent. You, once, once you do this, you get in the habit of doing this. So just so you could take a look, I cut up my pine, pineapple. I buy fresh pineapple and I reuse a bag from a bread. See? Honey wheat bread. So... You need to put it somewhere. You can't put it in a container. It doesn't fit in almost anything. And that's how I make it happen. And then I buy celery. I usually go and I get my celery from the Amish because it grows far diff more different and far more abundant. Although, it's a lot thinner than this. And uh, let me just cut this part off. It's a lot thinner than this. What I do with the remains with the pulp and also pieces like this, you could actually replant some things. I'm not saying that you can replant this in particular, but I've already replanted successfully um, potato plants. Unfortunately, um, I just lost a bunch of pictures, so I can't show proof of that. So I'm starting from scratch, which is why I'm doing the juicing today. So let's get on with the juicing. But before I do, I just wanted to buy hot, show you how I bought a bunch of spinach. And normally, I've been going to the Amish, but you know what? Not everything they sell is really organic. And their bidding us of our local tax dollars is good to buy stuff in your local market. Uh, this was in the organic section in ShopRite. And it looks even better than the one I get from the Amish. Uh, so... The only thing I do agree with, I, I get the, 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 the kale from them. Normally, typically looks better. Uh, this year's is pretty, just as small as the same size at the supermarket. Um, and, but the, 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 the celery is abundant. When they give you a lot, they give you a lot. So I want, want to give you a little quick tour of the stuff that I use. And here we go. Okay, so now 